today is Thursday, April 27, 2023. I received this word at 321 this afternoon, Eastern Standard Time. Um, as always, take it back to the Lord in prayer. Uh, Getting you your word, ask for confirmation or clarification. Don't take my word for it. Uh, we are told to test the spirit. So I would encourage you to do that. This is what the Lord said. Darkness is covering the earth. Many of those who have come to a knowledge of the truth are now falling away from the faith they once proclaimed. They have chosen the broad and easy road. I do not enjoy seeing my people perish, but I am growing weary of stretching out my arm all day to a people who have shut their ears to my cries. O oh, rebellious house, you have hardened your hearts to the truth after you have tasted and seen that the Lord is good. How long do you expect me to look the other way? I said, acknowledge your guilt. Come to me with heavy hearts and a broken spirit. Seek me earnestly and I will receive you and wash away all your transgressions. I will wipe the stain I will wipe clean, sorry, the stain of your guilt, but instead you do what I hate. Your feet run swiftly to evil. There is no truth in you. You curse your neighbor, betray the wife of your youth. Speak slanderous words, cursing your brother and sister who were created in my image and likeness. You have never been mine. You defile the marriage bed, withhold help from the poor and oppressed, and your hearts are full of pride and self-indulgence. You expect mercy to be shown to you, but refuse to extend the mercy you are requesting. You justify your bitterness and resentment, storing up murder in your hearts. Shall I let the guilty go free? My people cry out, demanding justice, but why does that justice not apply to you? I am the son of righteousness, the spirit of truth, yet you have turned away from the truth, trusting a lie, becoming double-minded in all your ways, tossed like the waves of the sea by every doctrine your itching ears want to hear. There is no fear of God before your eyes. In an attempt to become wise, you have become fools, confounded by your own wisdom. Your pride has blinded your minds, veiling them to the truth. I am the way, the truth, and the life. There is a way that seems right to a man, but in the end is death. Broad is the road that leads to destruction, and many have chosen its path. Return to me and I will return to you. Seek me with your whole heart and you will find me. Sin has hardened their hearts, turning them back to stone. So because they have chosen to quench the convictions of my spirit, they shall eat the bitter fruit of their decision to reject the living God. I will turn them over to those who hate them and give them up to a debased and depraved mind, doing that which is detestable and an abomination in my sight. I will have no pity in their distress and their cries for mercy will go unanswered for they have rejected my outstretched arm. They have vexed my spirit and treated my sacrifice as a common thing. Holy, holy, holy is the Lord God Almighty who was and is and is to come. I am a merciful God, but I will not be mocked. That which a man has sown, he shall reap in full measure. I, the Lord, have spoken.